Only on two, extra protection for our paramedics who respond to dangerous situations every day. Muskogee first responders will now be outfitted with bulletproof vests and helmets. Uh, hopefully within the next year or two, all of uh, the companies in Oklahoma have this capability. Two Works For You reporter Tony Russell is live in Muskogee to show us how paramedics are staying safe during shootings and standoffs. Tony? More than 50 of these plate carriers and ballistic helmets are now inside the ambulances here at Muskogee County EMS. Paramedic Jordan Stevens is showing us the latest protection riding with them on ambulances. Because you never know what we're going to go into. The vests are in response to active shooters and high-risk calls. Just two months ago, a medic was shot in Dallas while taking care of a victim. Muskogee County can rest assured now that if an active shooter event happens in one of the schools or a public building or anything, that we're going to be there, we're going to be able to treat the people right then, but we're also going to be protected so that we're not going to be a casualty at all. Paramedics say the vest will allow them to get to patients faster while keeping the medics safe too. Steven says the training is changing, where paramedics are now responding right behind police officers. We just wanted to embrace this. Uh, next month, we are having a, a company-wide training for active shooters. And that active shooter training is scheduled for just a couple of weeks, right around the time we get ready for school. Again, all of this equipment donated, public donations, for these very protective pieces of armor for our first responders. Reporting live in Muskogee, Tony Russell, two works for you. Good.